completely community-driven stretch of mountainous dirt bike trails snaking their way through the urban sprawl of Houston, Texas. The Ant Hills, as they are known, began in the early 1970s as a pastime for a few local dirt bikers. You know, it's underground, it's secretive, it's, you know, people know about it, but people don't know about it. What it is really is where a bunch of BMXers or bike riders get together and build whatever out of dirt and basically get together and hang out and just have a good time. It's about as close as you're going to find to a pro level uh, jump park. Um, it's not funded by anybody. It's all volunteer work. Um, the people who uh, work there ride there. You know, I've made many a trip out here and even in the middle of the night with lights just to work on a section of trail. Or you might have to get out there and dig for a couple hours, move some dirt. It's really frowned upon to, to just show up and ride and leave and not contribute anything. From their origins 40 years ago, they have witnessed the land around them evolve from cattle farms to skyscrapers and pavement. Created by a few sweaty guys with shovels, saws, and several miles of undulating land, the Ant Hills have become an independent biker sandbox, open to anyone with the drive to build and ride. The trail's existence on Harris County floodland property makes their maintenance a type of eco-terrorism and keeps any construction operations strictly underground. Also, their continued quality or responsibility of absolutely everyone that rides. The lack of organization and the extreme respect all riders and workers have for the land has been the key factor in the Ant Hill's survival for nearly half a century. In my documentary, I will explore the trails, analyze their symbiotic relationship with the surrounding community, and take a trip into the trail's history by talking to a few men who were there at the very beginning.